Hi, and let's learn some Chinese. I'm Stephanie, and welcome to my channel. Today marks 小鼠. So in this episode, we are going to talk about what is 小鼠 anyway. 小 means small, and 鼠 means heat. So 小鼠 means a small heat. You can call it like slight heat. It is the time that indicates the hot times are still yet to come. It's one of the 24 solar terms here in China. As a matter of fact, it is the 11th solar term. Now, after 小鼠 follows 大鼠, big heat. 大 means big. Obviously, it's the opposite word of 小. 大鼠 means the temperature has reached its highest peak. So that's like the hottest time of the year. That's why 小鼠 indicates the hottest days are just ahead of you. Now on this day, it also marks that most regions in China are entering into their thunderstorm season. If you're here in China already, you might have heard it on the news. Now, Xiaoshu often happens between July the 6th and 8th. It varies, so it belongs to the lunar calendar. If you are here in China and you set your phone language into Chinese, you will find solar terms right there on your calendar. Along with the lunar calendar, it will indicate which day is which. In the ancient times, on this day, normally we shi xin, shi means eat and xin means new. So shi xin means eat something new. Usually, we eat the new rice. Part of the rice goes to sacrifice as the offerings to your ancestors and gods, and part of the other rice, you share it with your neighbors. So that indicates a good hope for the harvest in the autumn. All right, so this is this mini episode about Xiao Shu, one of the 24 solar terms here in China. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.